Arriving at the Qingzhou Container Terminal, what stands out is the cutting-edge automated operation of the wharf. There are hardly any workers on site, but the containers are still being loaded, unloaded, and transported in an orderly way. The cranes are operated remotely through an intelligent terminal operation system developed by the local team. Guided vehicles equipped with cameras and sensors keep the containers moving between the berth and the storage yard. The smart technology ensures the cargo reaches the railway container center station that's not far from the shipyard. The railway central station is right behind our berth, and with the efficient operation of our automated equipment, we can directly send containers to the railway central station. The continuous optimization and improvement of information technology enable us to achieve 24-hour operation, even 100, 1,000, or even 10,000 hours of non-stop operation, which is unimaginable for traditional ports. The terminal operations are said to be 30% more efficient than in traditional ports, and with only 10% of the workforce. Uh, Currently, the railway central station and the automated container terminal are working together to further optimize the sea rail intermodal transportation process. The goal is to achieve seamless connectivity in terms of infrastructure, operational integration, and information exchange, fully leveraging the advantages of this new passage. Two additional berths with a capacity of 200,000 tons each are under construction. They are expected to be operational by the end of the year bring Qingzhou port one step closer to becoming a major gateway for China's new international land-sea trade corridor.